Medic 96 is at the scene of a man seriously ill in the Chinatown district of San Francisco. After offering medical aid, the man is transported to Kaiser Hospital in Geary. I spent an entire shift with San Francisco Fire Department Paramedic Unit 96 as they respond to numerous calls around the city. Here they responded to a report of a woman down at the BART steps just outside of Nordstrom. On any given day, there are about 17 to 18 medic wagons responding to 911 calls citywide, and about 15 during the evening. Currently, they have 40 medic wagons. Five are brand new. The oldest is 15 years old and has more than 222 thousand miles recorded. They are short-staffed. In fact, according to Chief Joanne Hayes White, they need to hire an additional 30 to 50 qualified people to build them up to acceptable levels. This is why. The state of California requires 80 to 90 percent of all 911 medical calls to be handled by the San Francisco Fire Department exclusively. Right now, they can only handle about 73 percent. But to their credit, they are up from 69 percent. They have to deal with an aging fleet and equipment issues, but according to the chief, 10 new medic wagons are on order. However, with the Affordable Care Act, there may be a larger demand for 911 services, which could put a bigger strain on the fire department to reach the state-required mandate. And if you toss in the frequent flyers, those are the people that abuse the medic system daily. The cost for saving lives in San Francisco could skyrocket, or worse. In San Francisco, Stanley Roberts, Cron 4 News.